And so the girls, once again, have come from the hive to our neighbor's tree. It's a fig tree here. Now we're looking for the queen, which we hope she's in the midst of all this. Or down there. Or down in the box it's below. So we've let the bees calm down here. If you notice the buzz level has gone down quite a bit. And they're all waiting for their, uh, mom. for mom. <laughs> and to find out uh, where they're going to their new home. If we get them all in the box, we'll bring them to a new home out in the field by us. So we see this bee right here fanning. In other words, she's blowing a pheromone out of the nasinov plant to let the other bees know that the queen, and we hope, is somewhere here in this box. And now, as you may see, the bees are absolutely walking up the sticks and into the hive because there's a bunch of bees in the hive there. If you look close, you'll see they're fanning their wings to let the bees outside know the queen is here. And the bus is ready to go. We are fixing to put this box in the car and take it out to our field location. And hopefully they'll uh, stay with the nuke and not fly on from there. We'll let you know. So here we are out in the field with the rest of the hives. We have the uh, queen and most of the bees in these two boxes, one in a nuke and another in a cardboard box here. And we're going to carefully take the nuke out and place it in its new home. And hopefully they'll stay and not, uh, not wander on to new fields. Okay, other way, turn around. There you go. Hey girls. Oh, oh, you're coming out the lid. Hey girls. Yeah. The plan is to open the Amazon box. Amazon does ship, please, but uh, not like this. This would be the ultimate Amazon DoorDash. These are the bees that uh, we shook off the tree into the box and they will make their way down into the hive as soon as you pull out the plastic bag. I'm not going to pull the whole plastic bag out, I'm just going to pull out a corner. Okay? Just pull out a corner so they have just some, like that. So some, rain. some air and if it rains and tonight. for them to ventilate given the number of bees that are in there. And so another unintended morning of uh, the wonders of beekeeping <laughs> comes to so far a happy end. The bees will hopefully find lots of forage out here with the other hives, with their sisters, and not come back to the hive they were and not fly on to parts unknown. So thanks for being with us. And if you got questions, you want to learn anything, you want to set up a bee safari if you're here in Israel, you want to buy our honey, let us know. And uh, hit the subscribe button on the Facebook and YouTube pages. Make sure to hit subscribe and like so we can let you know how our beekeeping is going and how the girls are doing after all these adventures. Thanks for being with us.